Hello, everybody, to today's conversation, which I'm conducting in the frame of our CZ talk series, which is part of a broader project, which is called WEP24, and which aims at raising awareness among our members also for the upcoming European elections. Today with me is uh, Rainer Lindholm, member of the board of the Finnish TVML. I'm sure, Rainer, you will say a couple of words about the trade union. Rainer, welcome, and it's a pleasure to have you with, with us. Yeah, thank you, Klaus. Thank you. The TVML, which I'm in, is the trade union for the custom officers, and uh, my responsible there is uh, international affairs, which mainly is with with SESI, and then we of course have this NTO, which is the Nordic Customs Organization. So we have a lot of connection also to the our Nordic custom organizations. Rainer, what are the, the big challenges at the moment for the for your members and for TVML? Uh, let me say so that uh, this challenge has been already for a quite a long time that the young people don't want to enjoy the the, the union and uh, uh, we don't actually know what we have to do we have to try to to contact them and and so on but they don't really want to enjoy and if they are member of our union they don't want to come in the in and work they just are in the union so there is it's, it's a little bit challenging but of course uh, tvml belonging to this akava the, the central uh central union uh, and um, they actually have grown grown a little bit so that looks good for us the other other uh, central unions uh, they have less members nowadays and it's going to be less and less all the time but for our central organization akava is looking good and um, of course when we are working for the government that means that if it gets pay raised, you get it anyway are you belonging to the union or not i think that's the actually the key word what what other things we have can offer our members and of course we have a lot, lot of different things we try to to do for our members there are some some holiday we have some holiday places around Finland and even one in Estonia and we rent them out for our union members and and so on but of course we we uh, the the challenges for us for the moment is of, of course the eastern border there is a big challenge because it's it's totally closed and and we are really trying to to help those who are are working there and our chairman especially is I, I think mainly every day connected over there and 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 try to help them and uh, so far it has looking quite good because nothing really really you know happens with our our members there they still can be on their jobs but of course they are pendling around the Finland for the moment so it's it's I think quite stressy for the for the members for the moment, and um, and uh, yeah, that's actually the mainly the challenge we have in the in the union for the moment. So there is quite a lot everyday work with the eastern border because it's changing all the times, and the information from there are changing every day, and 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 so on. So it's it's it's. It's good, but of course, in the eastern border is also this cooperation which we have there. So there is also the border guard we have to to work together with, and it's it's quite good cooperation. Good cooperation. Uh, we have some some problems in the past, but but the new generation who is now working, they are working quite quite closely and of course there is a police also sometimes so it's it's a good cooperation we have 
have for a long time police, customs, and the border guard. But yeah, that's that's the mainly the challenges uh, we have, and some good points also from from it. So basically, you you have uh, two major challenges. One is the the challenges faced by your union itself, by TVML, and then on the other side, let's say the challenges which are due uh, to the how could I say to the geopolitical um, tensions also with uh, having this long border with Russia, where you try to support, of course, the border guards. Yeah. Um, you, yeah, you mentioned yeah. also SESI and the NTO. What what is the importance for you of of of, be, of let's say cross border cooperation be, among trade unions between trade unions, and uh, what does SESI mean for you? Um, uh, this is uh, actually my opinion about it because I uh, we need to have some contacts which are close to 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 Brussels and uh, of course the Commission over there. And uh, we have, I don't remember now, years when we, we came to SESI, so we are quite happy about it. And we, we can see that you are well connected in, in, in there. So as you, Klaus, told me, if you need some help, you, you give us your help. And uh, you actually was invited also here in, in Helsinki in the Finnish parliament. And we were discussing about it. So I see that we have to have some kind of help very, very close over there in, in Brussels. So, and, uh, and of course, you have this kind of trainings, like now is the web training going on. It's, it's really good because you know people from other, other countries, from the customs how they are working in the unions, how they are dealing with the members, as we already I was mentioned about the problem, how, how to get the new, new members, young young members in the in the in the union. So it's 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 quite and a special thing which I really enjoy was the the safety in the work, for example. That was was a good program and uh, I was involved in that and it was nice to hear not just from the customs from the from the hospital view and uh, from the even the, the the from the school school sector how they what kind of problem they have there and and uh, when you are looking overall we have uh, the problem with the safety in Europe and and uh, and I, I actually see that Sesi is the one who can help help because it's it's a, it's a huge problem around. Are you working in in the fire or hospital or in the customs, police or military? So yeah, and NTO of course it's we are we have for many 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 years already. I think it's established in. 1945 NTO, so we have a good connection to our our Nordic countries and how they are working, and and of course um, we have some some problems because uh, all not all the Nordic countries they are not member of European Union, and some are member in the Schengen and someone is not, but anyway. Uh, we have actually in the NTO also the similar problem that how to get the members in the union and we are struggling with that the whole Scandinavia also and try to think about what to do and hopefully we we, we get it someday. Yeah, That's I mainly. Also, yeah. Sorry. Yeah, I think also the program you mentioned, uh, the exchange program among young people, among uh, the unions of CESI is is a proper, probably a potential way also to to how could I say encourage people to join unions also from because of the international angle. Um, yeah, so it's, <clears throat> it's good because yeah, of course, like I mentioned, because now when we have this exchange, which was the last two weeks here in 
in Finland from, from Luxembourg. So the, the young people could see that, oh, we, it's, it's really working. It's, it's, uh, it was about our union and the SESI. So it's, it's, it was working together and it, it, it was really good. And, and they could see that the young people from, from, in, uh, came from the Luxembourg to, to, to Finland and look how we are working there and how the union is working. And uh, I, I think that's helping a little bit the situation. I hope so. Um, right now, we, 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 we are having the European elections now very soon. What is, what is your message to your members? Or what is the message to the citizens in Finland? Yeah, first of first of all, I have to say that uh, TVML is not uh, we are not pol political situated, so we are uh, independent in that that way. But uh, of course, they who want to vote, they vote. We cannot force them to vote or say don't vote. But my opinion is, my own opinion is that we should vote because that's the future future. What we are voting now is the future of the European Union. How is it, how is it going to work? And and uh, of course, Finland is a, is a small country, so so that's that's the only way we can how everyone can you know. If you don't vote, then you don't complain about European Union. So if you vote, then then you can see. How is it affect? Do it do it really helping helping? It depends on how how you are thinking about European Union. And uh, I think most of the people, because he was voting for the European Union anyway, so the the my, majority was anyway that we should enjoy the European Union. But of course, uh, when we are thinking about how many people are voting in Finland for European Unions. Uh, so it's um, it's a little bit uh, you know confused that for example now the plastic bottles here in Finland because we have recycled them for a long long time and now they are changing the whole thing that means that it's going to cost a lot of money and that affects people they only see the bad things and not the good things so it's but my 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 opinion is that you should vote that uh, it's it's good and uh, that's the way you can you can um, actually take a good look who you vote and uh, what is his idea and what is he what he is going to do if he if he get voted in 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 the parliament in the, in 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 Brussels so let's Let's see. Let's see how it's going to be. It's it's beginning of the summer here, so and the spring has been very bad here. So I hope people people go and vote. I know many thanks for your time. Uh, best of luck to you, to your chairman, and of course to the TVML. And hope to see you soon either in Brussels or in Helsinki. Take care. Yeah, great things to all in, in Brussels also, and uh, all the other members who are. In Sesi. See you in the summer. See you. Thank you very much. Bye yeah. bye. Bye bye.